Okay guys, here's the engine. Uh, before you run it, uh, for the first time and every time, go ahead and put uh, two drops of oil in here, a drop on either side of the crank bushing, and um, one over here on the crank pin, right there. So um, the piston will get lubricated from the uh, air being injected from here. Okay, so um, let's see if we can get it started. I've already run it before. So um, if you're running for the first time, you're gonna have to run about 30 PSI. Um, I run it at 20 after it's broken in, um, and then I can vary the speed here at the knob. Uh, it'll probably run as low as uh, six or seven. All right, um, if you try this at home, uh, do this at your own, um, at your own risk. Okay, um, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a little throttle in the, this direction. If the throttle's pointed that way, the top of your flywheel goes that way. So, here we are. We can... Okay, to reverse it, just grab, just pull the lever the other way. All right, let's do a quick RPM check. Looks like we're about 570. Looks like we get it down to about 200, which is pretty good for a plastic steam engine. And um, let's see what our top speed is. Spitting oil at me. All right. Takes a second to get up to top speed. Gotta wait for that VTEC, yo. So we got some kind of weird fluctuation. Okay. I'm gonna guess 14, 15 is about where we're at. About 1473. Alright guys, that's it. I'm gonna go work on the next project. Put this thing in like a 1997 Honda, 98 Honda Civic. Probably be able to do about 10 seconds. And uh, you'll be robbing uh, semi trucks from computer parts all day in no time. All right, bye.